All right, so we're gonna talk about why trees die. Well, I can assure you trees die for usually numerous reasons. Um, a lot of people say, oh, this tree has beetles. That's what killed the tree. Well, in reality, a lot of times trees are unaffected by beetles because beetles won't bore into a healthy tree. So in general, beetles don't affect healthy trees. This tree we think was hit by lightning even though we couldn't see the evidence of the lightning strike anywhere on it um, we've seen the after effects dying branches large sections dying and then eventually the whole tree died other trees in the area which we've already pruned were affected by the same lightning strike that's called side flash the side flash will travel from the original strike tree to any side trees that are within the reachable distance so lightning is one way trees die um, usually it's called the mortality spiral mortality spiral in reference to a combination of different events to a tree that will actually lead to the tree's demise it's usually not just one thing that kills the tree it's usually a combination of factors we had less rain this year the tree got struck by lightning tree was stressed the beetles came now the tree's dead the tree got more rain this year the roots were saturated the soil was saturated it created an anaerobic environment the tree was unable to do gas exchange as it should and suffocated the roots which would show the same exact symptoms of a tree that was actually receiving not enough water so sometimes people get that confused too much water and not enough water are both bad for the tree. It stresses the tree out. The tree loses roots, the tree is unable to feed itself, the tree is stressed out. Beetles come, lawnmower hits the base of it, peels off sections of the cambium layer, the tree is unable to transport nutrients, the tree dies. Now in the case of the southern pine beetle, which was a very invasive, highly proactive killing machine. Um, beetles can kill a tree, but it's not the beetle itself that was killing all the pine trees. It was actually what it transmitted. Now, there's a whole video I have on my other channel about pine beetles. Um, I'll post the link in the description. Essentially, the pine beetles transmit what's called a blue stain fungi. Blue stain, blue stain fungi clogs the vascular system of trees. The blue stain fungi basically strangles the tree in an effect similar to girdling. So it's in general not just one thing that kills the tree unless of course something like this happens and somebody cuts the tree. Now a lot of times on a healthy tree you may get some what's called sucker growth or sprouts that come out of the trunk. Now those are dormant buds that will come out of the trunk tissue because the tree says, I still have this good root system. I was fine, I lost all my foliage, but I still have stored energy. So I'm gonna go ahead and grow some roots, or I'm gonna grow some branches and continue to feed myself and just ride this gravy train as long as I can and then produce more acorns and allow my genes to thrive and spread. So trees don't wanna die. They die from usually a combination of factors. Thanks for watching this episode. If you like this video, hit that like button and subscribe. Make sure you go back and check out some of our previous episodes like the pine beetle or the tree life. Thanks again.